I don't ship until I have the cash in hand. Good day. Uh, Mr. Scrooge, I presume. Indeed you do, sir. You don't know us. Nor do I wish to. My name is Poole, and this is Mr. Hackett. Excellent. Now, if you'll allow me to pass. Uh, let me explain, sir. At this festive season of the year, it seems desirable that those of us with means should make some slight provision for the poor and destitute who suffer greatly at this time. Provision? Are you seeking money from me then? Many thousands are in want of common necessaries. Hundreds of thousands are in want of common comforts. Are there no prisons? Plenty of prisons. The workhouses, are they still in operation? They are. I wish I could say they were not. The treadmill, the poor houses, still in full vigor? All very busy, sir. <laughs> I was afraid from what you said that something had stopped them in full force. A few of us are endeavoring to raise a fund to buy the poor some meat and drink and food and warmth. Oh, what can we put you down for, sir? Nothing. You wish to be anonymous? I wish to be left alone. Since you ask me what I wish, gentlemen, that is my answer. I don't make merry myself at Christmas, and I can't afford to make idle people merry. My taxes help to support the public institutions which I have mentioned, and they cost enough. Those who are badly off must go there. Many can't go there, and many would rather die. If they would rather die, perhaps they had better do so and uh, decrease the surplus population. Surely you don't mean that, sir. With all my heart. Now, if you will go about your business, gentlemen, and allow me to go about mine. 